So tell me, what's going on with your character this season? This season? There's maybe a power vacuum in Alexandria. And you know, uh, Deanna Monroe, Tova's character, is grieving from the loss of her husband and her son. And I think that there is a power vacuum that maybe Rick, you'll see, goes into action. I think you, you meet a guy, it's very much a spillover from last season. He's, he's not willing to put up with or tolerate incompetence for the sake of his family. If you can't keep up with him, then you're going to get left behind. He's a pretty tough leader, but I like to think still fair. How crazy is this season? It is gut-wrenching. It is frightening. It's, it changes. So many people just go through so many amazing arcs. It's just really exciting. It's riveting. Well, this whole season is... Andy said this thing where the first episode is kind of like pulling back a bow and arrow. And it's, you're, you're struggling to keep it tense and then you let go of it and that's how this episode ends and it, that arrow flying at you is pretty much this whole season. There will be a lot of blood this season, you know, walker blood and human blood. I mean, it, we've come out, uh, I think, one through nine are the biggest, most ambitious episodes we've attempted. This season's a roller coaster. It's a, I mean, it's like boom, 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 and it's like, ah, 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 ah. you know, it's, it's, it's intense. It's an intense season. The scope is so large, and I think this is something that obviously we've never done on our show before, and um, it's almost too big. You know, the bar is set so high on this show because the fans deserve it, and we just keep trying to get over it, you know? And I think we've pretty much maxed out on what you, you're capable of shooting in an eight day episode. You know, I mean, we're still in it. I was laying in bed last night trying to remember lines for Wednesday. So, you know, I mean, it, we're still in it, but this, this season's our biggest, craziest season by far. Does everyone make it out? Uh, I mean, nobody uh, ever yeah. all makes it out. There, there's a joke, like, you, you come to The Walking Dead to die. That's oh, yeah. the joke. Yeah. <laughs> From the clips I've seen, it looks like you're taking over. It looks like he's going to be stirring. He's going to be stirring up some mess. But that's about, you know, that's about as much as I can say that's about it? what's going to happen. Yeah. Carol is. Uh, she's still playing the game. She's trying to get a, a read on, on uh, Morgan now. You know, he has a very different point of view about how to survive in this world. The two of you all. I want to know who's going to win at the end. Who's going to win at the end between the two of you guys? Oh, you know it's going to end up as a love fest. Yeah, it is. But yeah, we're lovers, not fighters, but we're willing to fight for love. I mean, <laughs> yeah. How close have you all become as a cast? Oh, I mean, it's been six years with one of the greatest people, one of the greatest people over here, and, um, you know, it's, it's awesome. Yeah, it's Aww. awesome. It's, uh, he's prickly. I don't think the show could be made without a closeness of the cast. It's a hard show to make. Uh, the conditions are tough. And everybody balls out because we have to, and we love each other, and we want to support each other, so it's good.